of defending back to back yes. are very, 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 very nice. And the beauty about it is that why we performed so well in the women race is that we took the podium finish and we took the very first, the sixth position mm -hmm. in the world. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it was commendable performance. Though we yeah. lost the men. Uh, how about the men's title? You know, the men's title. Mm -hmm. We have always been struggling. Mm -hmm. If you look, even the last mm -hmm. squad, Sawe was there again, mm -hmm. and uh, the performance again mm -hmm. is still wanting. You know, the moment, the transition, as I was telling you earlier mm -hmm. on, is. A, a, every season, every athlete or every player, there is a season for transition. Mm -hmm. And I think that is what is happening to, to Kenyan team right now. Mm -hmm. Because the likes of Kamoro, those people who have ruled Faith, Kibiego, and those people who have ruled, mm -hmm. they are transitioning. Mm -hmm. You look at Faith. Faith is now, this is the last year she's particip participating mm -hmm. into the track. Mm -hmm. She's going to the rest because, again, age, mm -hmm. age race. And then you're looking about tomorrow. She's Kamoro, to again, mm -hmm. he pulled. He was in the mm -hmm. trials mm -hmm. for world cross mm -hmm. country. Even we thought he's going because he was number two. Mm -hmm. But again, he came it was a build-up for the coming race, which is in April. Uh, he's going to Boston mm -hmm. to, to run at Boston. So mm -hmm. it was an endurance race for him to just gauge mm -hmm. where he is. So men-wise, we are still far. Ethiopian have learned the good about us, and they beat us again. Aregai, last time again, he took silver. Mm -hmm. Again, this time he took silver. But we were lucky to get a bronze yes. this time round. And of course, the mix really, Kenya really putting up. Oh, uh, we are good. Great, yeah. We, we great are run. good. Yes. Uh, the man, Munguti, yes, is, Munguti, yes. Munguti has delivered. You remember 2017, yes. the time for Mora again. Mm -hmm. Munguti mm -hmm. delivered. Yes. He gave us the gold mm -hmm. only for Mora now to polish what was remaining. When they thought they had finished at 150 yeah. mark, yeah. Mora... Getting past the Dos Santos, but right? Dos Santos, yes. and you can see mm -hmm. the form that Dos Santos is. So those are the, 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 the stages, development stages, because if you look at Dos Santos right now, is a world champion, he's Olympic a champion. premium mm -hmm. athlete. You know, mm -hmm. those people who get money for appearance fee mm -hmm. is so huge. Mm -hmm. And I think he's enjoying his efforts mm -hmm. of yeah. going to where he is. And, and it was also uh, great, not, um, it was good to see Ethiopia struggling in the mix, really. Yeah, yeah, yeah. An yeah, athlete yeah. losing a shoe. It, it was a happy moment for <laughs> us because they took our record. Yeah. What else can we do is to show them that we are still there. Mm -hmm. We are still the best in the world. We are still the best in Africa. And we'll continue being because the production that we have, you look at our youth, they are coming up. The build-up is so well and... We are taking records. We are winning every race. Look at the, the, the race that has just happened, the one you're going to talk about, especially the Tokyo race. Mm -hmm. You see how Kenyan, we prevailed against a strong field that had been uh, brought or assembled up. Mm -hmm. So uh, uh, graduation-wise or development-wise, Kenya is always ahead of Ethiopia. Mm -hmm. And I don't see them beating us anytime soon. Kenya ruling yeah. the roost again. Yeah. That's in Serbia during uh, the World Cross-Country Championship. Uh, let's talk about the composition of the uh, Olympic marathon teams, which AK did uh, name this week in okay. Eldoret. Yes, the composition, let's begin with the men's team. Of course, mm -hmm. uh, we know that uh, the El Eliud Kipchoge, mm -hmm. you know, he's headlining that particular squad. Yeah. But we can talk about the rest of uh, the members who make up the team. Funny thing about that team is <laughs> because, uh, uh, likewise, this is my opinion, yeah. is... Uh, at the moment, uh, Eliud again, uh, he, the form or the shape that he, he used to be yes, in yes. is really now warning. Mm -hmm. And I think his progression now, instead of now going up, mm -hmm. the progression of Eliud now is, 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 is landing. Mm -hmm. it's, mm -hmm. it's staggering going back now to the level that the body now is it's not fading, responding. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, the body, you know, with athletics about endurance, about the response, about how you walk up mm -hmm. and all that. Those comes into factor. Uh, to play when you're in the field mm -hmm. and the funny thing about this team is that there are four actually three guys in that lineup mm -hmm. that beat Eliud Kipchoge mm -hmm. at Tokyo mm -hmm. two, uh, a week ago mm -hmm. so uh, this are uh, this Benson mm -hmm. who actually he gave him a double tragedy mm -hmm. he beat him mm -hmm. and then again he he arrested his course record of 20040 mm -hmm. to 202 no 200240 mm -hmm. to 20216 uh, so wiping that record again and then uh, Elliot even not being among us the top leading people because he finished actually top 10. He was the number 10. Mm -hmm. And if you see the time that he ran again, 206. 206 is never, has never been Elliot's time. So you can see. And then if you go back again, the first race that he ran again, the performance again when you put together, it's, it's a little bit shaky. But look at Benson. Mm -hmm. Benson, Benson is growing progressively. Mm -hmm. He's a fighter and... 
I, I wish there was somebody that could have pushed him because running two or two in Tokyo, mm -hmm. it means that you're in one of the best shape because the weather patterns there, they aren't uh, favorable for, 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 for running a marathon mm -hmm. and going and breaking the course record and then pulling alone Timothy Kiplaga, who mm -hmm. has been named in the, in the team. Mm -hmm. And then the, 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 the wrap up, the person who wrapped the podium is Vincent Getich. Again, he was there. There was only one Munyao that was not among those people who was not, uh, who, who raced against Elliot. So for us, especially for the main team, we have one of the best. Yes. Surprisingly, this one I can predict, I don't see again a, a Elliot. Elliot defending. Yeah. It will be a tall order for him to defend this title. Given by the fresh legs that are in the team, but the prediction yeah. is the medal could remain in the country. Yeah, yeah. Ah, um, the medal is ours because we are ruling right now. If you look, we look, you know, with running, it's about statistics. Mm -hmm. Running, you never lie. Because running, if you tell me in 10 kilometers you can run 27, we just put you on the road. Mm -hmm. We put you on the track. Yeah. Then we click on the clock. Uh, yeah. Then we tell you, now go. Show us what you have. With running, you'll never learn. And then statistics, they help us to predict what might happen mm -hmm. in the near future. Mm -hmm. The yeah. women's composition? Uh, fantastic, fantastic. We might have a podium finish mm -hmm. with the women because we have one of the creamiest ever assembled team. Mm -hmm. Because I'm looking at Paris. Paris is a world-class athlete. Mm -hmm. He's among the top five female in the world we call such a, a layer of people mm -hmm. premier athletes appearance for such people is from 18 million to around 50 million for her to appear in a mm -hmm. race mm -hmm. that's the category that mm -hmm. this lady is mm -hmm. in mm -hmm. because she has been a champion she's the defending champion mm -hmm. she's the new york champion you see she has been trashing records since the time she came into because she never stepped onto the track she just ran one track race mm -hmm. then she found herself because she was training with people men mm -hmm. so she found herself joining them and then going and that has been the Chani, uh, one of the favorite or the, the best stories ever. Mm -hmm. You can sit down with Paris mm -hmm. and be told about. Look mm -hmm. at uh, the, the second individual is Helen Obiri. Helen mm -hmm. Obiri is one of the creamiest, again, mm -hmm. a marathon runner or runner that we have had. Mm -hmm. She has a history of double, double, that is 5,000, double silver medalist yeah. Olympic, yeah. Uh, double world champion, that mm -hmm. is 5,000, over the 5,000 uh, a distance mm -hmm. and when you look at her progression again even in the build up mm -hmm. she has been running so fantastic winning races mm -hmm. that people never expected her to win mm -hmm. we go to Rosemary mm -hmm. Rosemary Koswanjiru mm -hmm. one of the brilliant again women we have around best in Eldoret uh, Rosemary was the defending champion Tokyo Marathon actually mm -hmm. she was beaten this time to, to second place by an Ethiopian mm -hmm. which was okay but when we look at the time and the factors that were in the race mm -hmm. we say she's still in the shape she represented Kenya previously and you know she is, she is there to fight for, for it again. Mm -hmm. Then somebody else that is in the room, we have Lokedi, Sharon Lokedi. Sharon Lokedi is a former New York Marathon champion. Mm -hmm. And then I, I think uh, the list is, is done. Mm -hmm. I think there is no one else. So the cream that we have, I think nobody is going to compare with what we have. Mm -hmm. We will seal the podium, mm -hmm. especially on the women's side. Yes, of course, yeah. and also uh, Kenya staying on course for a place to honest lot at the while at the relays, that's at the Olympics, what are our chances? Of course, the national trials are ongoing as we speak at Nyayo. Statistically, because right now the weather, actually mm -hmm. we haven't seen the best of our people mm -hmm. because the weather is really affecting the performance because the times that are being run right now at Nyayo, mm -hmm. they are not those times that we can really bank on mm -hmm. because I I if you look at, uh, we have been having the 400 uh, races, mm -hmm. people are running at 46 and the Fastest person has been Zablon Ekwam. Zablon has run 40, 40, 20, no, 45, 21. Mm -hmm. Qualifying is 40, 45 flat. We look at 200 again, uh, nearly 100 meters. Uh, we expected uh, Marco Tieno. Marco Tieno actually has been the leading. Actually, he wasn't leading. Has no Chege led because he ran 10, uh, 10 36. Mm -hmm. And the qualifying time, people are looking at 10.02. Mm -hmm. So we don't have time right now. Omanyala has run two, 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 200 meters. Mm -hmm. he, he was the fastest in the entire field with 20, 20, 20, 21. Mm -hmm. So again, that time, even himself is saying, I, I thought I had really done my best, mm -hmm. but it wasn't coming because the weather fa mm -hmm. factor is affecting because the body is too cold. Mm -hmm. Even if you warm up, it will take time for the body to get that mm -hmm. to the level that it's supposed to be. So the weather today has really affected our team mm -hmm. and we hope that the performance or as they go to us going to the camp yeah. something good might happen yeah, of course and in Nassau yeah. Bahamas we have um, we can keep the hope alive of them getting the qualifying times yeah yeah yeah, yeah. For the Olympics, yeah. yes yes it's Bahamas a qualifying event yes let me tell you we, we we have been good Kenya is recognized worldwide 
Uh, but you know, we have been lacking sprinters. But with the effect of Manyala coming into place is that uh, Kenya has really, we have born, uh, we have inborn talents that have been neglected. People were not focusing on the short races because they thought we are not good at them. But look, now we have like, somebody like Zablon Ekwam yeah. running in such a weather and then you're running good time like 45, 5, 45 seconds. That is good time that you can achieve. If the weather was good, s that man could have gone below 45. Mm -hmm. So which means that if you look at him statistically or gradually how he has been meaning, mm -hmm. uh, progressing, we see the progression is going. Again, look at him. You know, Zab Zab Ekwam is mm -hmm. a KDF individual. Mm -hmm. You know, with KDF, it's not the, 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 the training session that they go through mm -hmm. is not the same as what a, a P prison mm -hmm. and Kenya police go through. Mm -hmm. You know, with KDF, uh, their first priority is not about running. Mm -hmm. First priority is you are an army officer. Mm -hmm. They train you to the full, mm -hmm. full period of training. So again, that one loading and everything, the mileage goes to zero. So building up, coming back, it will take you time. It has taken time almost two years for Zablon Ekam to be where he is. Mm -hmm. So uh, statistically, mm -hmm. we see ourselves, the team that we are having, especially for four, mm -hmm. four by 100, mm -hmm. I tell you we will be on the podium. Mm -hmm. If we we can take, if we don't take gold, mm -hmm. we'll take a bronze because we are having Omanyala. Mark is starting, mm -hmm. then we are having Hezbon, mm -hmm. then we are having uh, Mike Mokamba, mm -hmm. and then Omanyala is going to wrap up the game. So I see ourselves at Bahamas. Mm -hmm. We will podium. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes, and of maybe uh, the. You know, the importance of having uh, Omanyalas and Mary Moraz in this particular, in the mix-up, in the relay team. Yes, yes. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mora has been on fire. Mm -hmm. I, I think I it's her season. Yeah, she won the gold in 400. Yeah, yeah, she won yes. gold at mm -hmm. uh, uh, Africa. Africa yeah, yes. she's the champion. And then she's the world champion again, when you look at it. And then the, her main opponent is uh, Ating Moon. Mm -hmm. I, I think Moon, I think the transition of changing coaches, mm -hmm. it really affected her. Mm -hmm. And that is one thing we also need to look at. Mm -hmm. For Manila performance, yes. I'm really in, 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 in doubt Although I've been talking to him, he's coming even to my place. Mm -hmm. But uh, I'm really in doubt the transition that the, the transition they have used at this particular moment. You know, when you build up to Olympic uh, or to an Olympic loss, mm -hmm. you need consistency. Mm -hmm. Consistency is very key, mm -hmm. especially for, shit, for these short races. Mm -hmm. And I don't argue about mm -hmm. changing coach. Mm -hmm. You can mm -hmm. change coach for your mm -hmm. progression, yeah. but the timing of changing the coaching mm -hmm. is what really matters. Because with coaching, especially for short distance, I have my own program on how I want you to perform, mm -hmm. which means we're going to start from zero mm -hmm. so that you can take what I have. Mm -hmm. So you are trashing everything that this mm -hmm. man had been trained from somebody else. Mm -hmm. So starting from zero, building it up mm -hmm. to the level that you want this individual to be, mm -hmm. with the time frame that we had, it's eight months the Olympics, which is the premier de la cream for any athlete mm -hmm. in the world, then you change the course in between to build you up even to come and fall into that system will mm -hmm. take you around six months minimum. Mm -hmm. It must take you a progression of two years for you to be mm -hmm. where that coach mm -hmm. is pr uh, pr predicting mm -hmm. or wants you to be. Mm -hmm. So there is an issue about a performance for this year. Something to watch out. Mm -hmm. You watch on 20th mm -hmm. at Kip Kaino. Mm -hmm. We might be surprised. Mm -hmm. There's a young man coming from the Botswana, mm -hmm. Tebogo. Mm -hmm. That man might surprise us. Mm -hmm. It's the a person to watch. Yeah, the world silver medalist, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And he's in great shape. You have seen him at South yeah, Africa Grand yes, Prix. Yes. Trashing records, yeah. right, left, center. Yes. Know. All that about uh, the qualifiers for the world relays that's happening in Nassau, uh, Bahamas. That's on 4th and 5th of next month. Remember, just like um, John has mentioned, Kenya is gunning or looking for a ticket to the Olympic Games. And in the mix, some of the dependable names in Kenya's athletic history are all putting their lives on the line for the country so that we go for the release for the first time. It's been a while before Kenya really was at the release, at the Olympics especially. Thank you so much, John Vaslin. Any time, Are you going back to Nyayo? Yeah, yeah, I'm heading to Nyayo. I mm -hmm. don't know somebody has uh, SMS me. I think <laughs> it's a colleague. Yeah. Maybe the naming of the team is happening right now. But uh, I know one thing I know is that what will be selected is the best that we have mm -hmm. at the moment. Mm -hmm. And w investment, you know, we have never invested into the short races. Yes. I pray that now these people take from the Manyala effect has mm -hmm. really changed yes. Yes. everything. And even now we are having many short mm -hmm. uh, sprint coaches. Yeah. They are coming on board and mm -hmm. doing everything that they can. Mm -hmm. But one thing we forgot about mm -hmm. that relay before mm -hmm. we wrap up yes. the show yes. is the effect of the baton changing. Mm -hmm. That is the mm -hmm. cause, major cause. It yeah. affects yeah. with relay. The training. Yeah, yeah. Yes. You will never 
never predict anything. Yes. Because even to the champions of champions, yes. even in the United States, yeah. the baton usually fall down. Yeah. Yeah. And then there's a limitation of exchange of the baton, which happens, you are supposed to change in a bracket mm -hmm. of 20 minutes, mm -hmm. meters. Mm -hmm. If you miss outside mm -hmm. that, you're mm -hmm. disqualified. Mm -hmm. If the baton falls mm -hmm. to pick up mm -hmm. again with anybody else, mm -hmm. it, 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 it might lead you to nowhere. So mm -hmm. it's a technical mm -hmm. event mm -hmm. that anyone can take. That's why I'm predicting mm -hmm. we will be yes. on the bracket list. All the best to Team Kenya at now today and all those that will be forming that particular team to Bahamas. Up next, I'll be speaking guests from uh, Black Falcons, that's Kabadi Club from Nairobi. Watch out for that one. And also the fans on, I'll be engaging Barry Silla later on. This is the touchline. Don't go too far.